All right. Hey, Dave. Hey, buddy. So we're doing these little uh, two-minute introduce yourselves to the to the website uh, recording bits. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, so uh, so which which imponderable are you? The chocolate one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the uh, I'm the young and still somewhat flexible one. Right. So you know, <laughs> if if you guys were the new kids, you'd be. Ah, uh, Jordan Knight. Nice. Because he had the best hair. Fair enough. Yeah, I can. I, I don't can know if that. he's the youngest though. <laughs> <laughs> so prior to the Couchathon, what's the longest you think you've managed to stay up at a stretch? Uh definitely twenty-four hours. But that's like in a setting where obviously I think you're moving around, or probably a house party where. Uh, you know, all of a sudden you're having a great time, but then the sun starts coming up. Right. Um, other than that, there's definitely been a few cases where I think, like, I worked really early in the morning, like, getting up at maybe 5.30 or 6, and then, uh, you know, maybe you're out all night, and then, you know. But uh, that's only, like, again, that's moving around a lot, and that's getting an early start. This is 11 o'clock in the morning start, right? Yeah. Uh, that's trouble. <laughs> <laughs> and also there's well like I'm a pretty big coffee drinker I guess so I don't know the, the, the a caffeine thing might be an issue for me at some point <laughs> that's, that's great so we can get we can get you sleep deprived and going through caffeine withdrawal oh yeah awesome nice. and I'll be like way irritable and uh, I'll definitely have a headache so this will be great <laughs> So I'm I'm running odds on which one of you will throttle uh, each other the first. Um, yeah, I, I'm. You've kind of got the height advantage, so I think I think yeah. you're probably safe to get through the first round. <laughs> Sweet. Are you, are you yeah, sizing I, up the other guys? Are you taking notes on if somebody's I got to go down so. so it's not you? I mean, I could see myself if I was irritable enough, maybe like I don't know, being a bit of an aggressor, but I don't think I'd be able to close it out because I'm probably the frailest and vulnerable. <laughs> But you know, there's charity on the line. You'd you'd throw down for charity, right? Oh, for sure. But Eric also like especially he knows that move where he'll grab your own hands and hit you with your own hands, <laughs> and then say, "Stop hitting yourself! Stop hitting yourself!" <laughs> that the, when we when yeah when we live together, he would do that sometimes. They, I think they had to outlaw that for the UFC. Uh, <laughs> that, that because when Eric too, and I lived together, the, uh, especially like in the winter time when we didn't have cable, it was it would be like sort of a couchathon type situation where you look out and there's like ten feet of snow outside, <laughs> just going crazy, stir crazy in there. <laughs> we um, one time we got so bored, he had like uh, I guess a handball, and we moved our couch out of the way, and we were playing handball against the wall until our neighbor came down and was like, what the hell's going on down here? <laughs> <laughs> but there's no activities. There's no sports that the couch is on, so that's trouble. Yeah, no, I, I know. It's going to be completely creative outlets. Okay, so you're Joe, <laughs> you're Joe Web Surfer. You've just come across this in, in yeah. 30 seconds. What What's going to get them to tune in? What can you promise the viewers right here, right now, to make it worth their time and money come Thursday? Absolutely um, unscripted and genuine moments of maybe partial insanity, uh, especially on the part, like you can definitely count on John losing his mind. We already suspect he's a little bit autistic, and I feel like this environment will be bringing out that side of him. He gets like bored and restless on the 30-minute like minute drive. <laughs> so I would say that it's going to have a very uh, realistic and probably reality TV feel to it, and who knows what might happen. Uh, see, to me, that just that spells entertainment right there. Absolutely, yeah. And uh, I also think that it'll be really funny to just, I don't know how much like stubble you're going to see grown or anything like that, but just seeing the actual like physical change like whenever this thing ends <laughs> will be pretty hilarious from when we started, like somewhat fresh-faced, I would think, at 11 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like the shitty like thing at a wedding where you keep like loosening your tie and then your tie's gone or whatever. <laughs> you kind of do the flip book of the wedding over time. And everyone's yeah. like, ties kind of uh, open up and lose the shirts. And... Yeah, but it starts off so fresh. <laughs> <laughs>